zero. I mean, you know what we're here for, right? There's no need even talking about it at this point. What is going on? Oh, the alt controls from NVIDIA. Why am I stuck behind a door? Ugh, Tarkov jank. So, yeah, my NVIDIA thing <laughs> is alt-tab, and it alt-tab in Tarkov causes some funky controls. We're looking for GPUs today, guys. Um, we are about what I would say probably five away from what we need for Bitcoin level two to have all 15 right out the gate. It's currently crafting. So that is what we're on about. That is what we're doing. And so far today, we've had a pretty good day of it. We started yesterday needing 15. And with what we have right now, I believe we're down to just about five more. So we're going to be hitting ground zero over and over again until we get those GPUs done. Thank you for being here. If it's your first time to the channel, welcome. And if you're back, obviously, you know, welcome back. Happy to have you all here. Um, been some good runs in ground zero. We are doing night raids because ground zero, I think you can um, get a lot of the night raids done without really killing visibility simply because there's so much lighting on the map. Um, so you can run it without MVGs. And a lot of times people simply don't think about running night raids. So more of a chance that we can get to some of these computers before they're searched, which is the biggest benefit in my opinion, because the point of this is to get to the computers first, wherever possible. So we may have someone who uh, spawned in in this building. I have to be careful for that, but we're going to push in regardless. And honestly, there's no point in being quiet about it. There's so much glass on the ground. Like when you push in, if someone's up there, they know, you know, <laughs> I would say push in quickly so you have a chance to defend yourself. If someone is up here, you are going to fight about it <laughs> more often than not. Just one of those contested areas. But as I'm saying that, I don't see an open door up there, which means either someone's not up there or someone's up there and they're smart and close the door behind them so no one would know. We shall see. Okay, nice, we get first crack again. This could be huge. Come on, man, we just need some good luck. You guys have been stiffing us on these last few raids. Can't complain, though. We had really good luck starting off the day, so, you know, all things considered. Don't think we have anything to complain about. Take it. All right, we got someone out there. Yeah, so someone's down there for sure. Not gonna be shy because I want to get these things searched. At the end of the day, like <laughs> that's gonna take priority for us, man. Uh, and uh, we are up here, so they're gonna be listening to us. Meanwhile, I'm gonna be making sure we get first crack at finding a GPU. That's what's most important to me. If they want to push, they can push. We'll defend, but for the moment. Want to just keep hitting these computers and let them figure out what they want to do. Um, I am going to just pull this out. We can put that there and we'll put that on the bar because we get into a scrap here. I don't want to be fumbling for heels. Jeez. Oof. I mean, that's worth, right? Hmm. 
ibuprofen probably at that point. Those are 70k a piece, so that's huge. Oh, come on, man. GPU here. Nope. Ugh. And there's also the chance that what we heard was AI, right? That's a possibility. Another reason I wouldn't worry about it, you know, just keep looting. Now, I don't know that we want to loot the ones that are out here under the circumstances, knowing that we heard something, but if there was a safer one of the two, it would be this one. So we'll see what we can get out of it. Cord. Okay. Only other one is this one. And it's, man, just a super dangerous computer to loot at this point in the raid. I'm uh, just going to play it safe and not do that because you just... You're exposed in the wrong place and people will take advantage. Especially if you're up here because they just assume that you're juiced, which generally is a safe assumption. Yeah, we definitely have some, some visitors. What kind of visitors? We don't know. Alright. I don't need any of that. We got. Let's go ahead and take that just in case. Alright. Extracts actually. Amercom, Mira. Okay, yeah. So, as before, we're going to push down and out to the left, go back into that room where we saw the other computers. I just saw someone. I think that was AI looking for us, just the way he was looking up. Probably okay here, but. Repack, just be on the safe side. There's night raids too, so there's less of a chance of us running into like big groups and stuff. But still, be careful. But if you run into someone who is doing night raids with NVGs, obviously if you're doing what I'm doing, you're going to be at a disadvantage. So, word to the wise, if you have NVGs, run them. If you don't, and you still want to do some night raids, Ground Zero is a great place to do that. Yeah, and there's a reason people do them, by the way. Look at any of the top streamers. A lot of the raids they do are night raids. It just uh, giving yourself a better chance at getting in and getting your tasks done. Unless you're pushing PvP, then day, right? When you're doing those quests where you need to kill people. Obviously, you're going to want to do the exact opposite, right? But right now, where we're just trying to make money, it's not really what we're on about. And any time you spend in the lobby is wasted time, in my opinion. Alright, let's uh, I'm gonna just drink that. Got some decent juice out of there though, even though we didn't get a GPU, we definitely have enough money to buy one. If not, maybe two. We'll see. Well, probably at least one. We'll see. I'm going to jump the gun and get too crazy. And yeah, 
I would just swing this section quickly because if someone's here, they've already heard you, and your best bet's probably to catch them off guard. Duffel over here. There's one over there. There's just duffels everywhere down here today, boy. or something just saw us or just saw somebody hmm. thought they were in front of us could be they were Silas. Just trying to listen there, but not sure where they would be. Don't hear them anymore. Just gonna head over here and see if we can't check these last couple computers, and then we will try to push Mira, see if we can at least get the juice that we got out of here. That quest update, I wish I could turn it off. Every time I turn around that corner, man, it dings and it's like, it just is unexpected. It causes an adverse reaction. <laughs> Uh all right. Okay. HDD, come on man. This is the one, right? This no. <laughs> no, it's not. Yes, that's not the one. But it did give us a CPU fan and a cord. So I think we uh, take advantage of those things. Right, right. And then we can move this down here. Okay, cool. Hey, let me move. Check the safe and then we'll head out. Store those there, right? Okay, yeah, let's do that. It's been pretty quiet, so I'm just gonna move. Um, heard that voice line when we were over underneath, but I didn't see any movement whatsoever. So we would just push the mirror, assuming it's still available. Um, it is. Quiet raid, but I'll take it. As long as we're getting out with some juice. I don't mind. Yeah, but let's see. 
nothing crazy and we are right where we need to be so we're gonna be pushing in see if we can search this real quick nope it's not been letting me search that I don't know if they changed it or if it's a bug or what but it's not working wow this thing oh wow I just get shot at Safe is open. There was definitely a single tap, but I don't know if it was for us or for someone else. We'll find out though. That's a scav. He's not aggroed to anyone, so we're gonna push on in. The scav out in the middle of the street was just circling. Standing still, circling, I mean, so. Whatever shot that was, tend to think it wasn't for us. It just seemed like it was. Okay, this may not have been looted. I don't know, there's not a lot in here, but could just be that not a lot spawned in here. Sometimes that happens. Let's see what we've got going on in this room. Come on, no door open. Ah, door's open. But hey... <laughs> We're going to check anyway, because ну, yeah, what up? Did you check? Oh, ow. <laughs> Fucking asshole. You are now a traitor scav, and you just gave me scav rep, dummy. Now, do you have anything I can use to heal myself? Oh, boy. Oh, yes, you do. Thank you. That was definitely a scav, probably a new player. I probably startled him. I said, what's up? Tried to be nice. And this dude's going to shoot me in the chest. Maybe he was scared because he has something good. What do you think? Look, man. Whoever's down there, understand. Hey man, that guy trader scabbed me, so um Oh, I appreciate you, man. Actually, I could use something to heal if you got it. I'm kind of fucked up. Here, have that gun and ammo I got off that guy. You got anything to heal, brother? No, you don't need it? Okay. All right, well cool. Oh man, thank you. Appreciate it. There you go. Hey, I dropped your heel back on the ground, brother. So, yeah, that guy got startled. Unfortunate for him. He should have... Uh, not shot me, but say la vie sometimes. It's unfortunate, like when you're learning this game. I remember doing the same thing on Scav, like not knowing who was coming up at me and like shooting when I shouldn't or not shooting when I shouldn't. <laughs> like it, it takes some time to adjust. It's a new thing for people, especially. So, do you have anything else worth grabbing? Honestly. Um, I'm going to grab this. Okay. Uh, so.
cool. Alright, good luck, brother. Alright, so we're healed. We've searched the big building. We're not done yet, though. I know we've got some things we could leave with, but... I want to make sure we check as many of these uh, GPU spawns as possible. So we're going to keep it moving now. I can't heal myself again, but... That's a problem for another day. Now, the way that works, if a scav shoots you first as a scav, you can kill that scav because they become a traitor the second they shoot another scav. And then if you kill them, you actually get bonus scav rep for killing a traitor scav. So that guy actually, unfortunately for him, just helped us out quite a bit. Because as we load out, instead of seeing the normal 0.01 that we would get for a successful extract, we'll get a bonus. Uh, I'm not sure how much it is anymore, but we'll get a bonus for killing the trader scav. And uh, it's a decent amount. So sometimes it's actually okay to kill scavs on your scav, guys. And in that situation, yeah, that dude's getting deuced every time. I don't know. Maybe he thought I just looked overly aggressive. I don't know. All right. Going down this way. Probably could have grabbed that guy's bag, actually, but... sure that that's accessible but no need to keep mm, don't want that either would be nice to have something to heal my head that guy made me bleed out almost but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it we're gonna push under the bridge and then out towards that back spawn point by Mira. The only difference being we won't be able to take Mira on our scab. We'll have to take Emmercom, so we'll have to keep pushing past that a little bit. There is something we need. We'll take that. Bad habits. I think we only need two more after that, actually. So Pretty stoked about it. AI scabs down here. You can tell just by the way they're moving. Oh. Someone just killed that guy. This guy just killed that guy. Uh-huh. So if he has a GPU, he's probably tucked it, but we're gonna check anyway. Because why not, right? those 
So not bad. Could take the most in, but I'm not really worried about it. I do want to see the rest of what he's got, though. And no, we're not done yet. <laughs> uh, only two rounds. All right. Well, appreciate that contribution. Shouldn't go around just killing scavs, my guy. So I believe we'll get extra bonus points for killing a PMC on scav too. So that works out. All right, we'll take it. Ram, no thank you. This computer has caps. All right, cool. So that was a pretty good run for our scav, all things considered. See if this guy checked the safe. Probably not. Nope. So I would always, if you're on your scav, especially and you're over here, check these because same loot pool as duffel bags. You can find some good stuff there. This guy had killed this guy. I don't know if the other guy checked his pockets or not. Probably. Got the VPO. No thanks. Oh, he killed this guy too. Oh, there's another Taz. Hey, we need that actually. Yep. All right. We had a find and transfer quest that wanted two of those. So that's enough reason for me to say we should probably check this bag and go ahead and get out. Apollo wires. Nothing we need. I hear someone over there. Yeah. So that guy was doing the classic dress like a scav move. All right. Running around with a Mosin, probably looking for Tarkov shooter kills, I would imagine. Um, unfortunate for us. I don't think he was expecting a player when he popped that corner either. Um, so, yeah. Hmm. Not worried about it. All right. Uh, I think we are clear here. This guy over there, I don't like the way he's peeking me. I don't like the way anyone ever peeks me, but yeah, no, let's get out, right? <laughs> All right, mm, not where we want to be. So coming in here, I'm going to just move on through. Like, I'm not even stopping there, honestly. I think we're going to try to make it across through this building and then across the street into the to the other place. Um, yeah, I'm not interested in pushing anything that's not GPUs, so given that we're not close to anything GPU related, we're just going to reposition. I may well run into some trouble here too, so we'll see. Not planning on taking a shy approach just because I want to get to those computers quickly. But also don't want to take a stupid approach, or at least not a completely stupid approach. A somewhat stupid approach I'm actually pretty okay with. Those tend to be the ones I take, honestly. <laughs> we got to work on that, I know. Oh, you're supposed to open. Oh, that's open because someone used it. 
but don't know where they went or if they're still around, so we're just gonna move. And yeah, on this one, depending on where I'm at, that's exactly the route I would take to get from there to here. Alright, first computer. Come on, give me some luck. Nope. Now we are going to be searching for those uh, CPU fans as well. Because we need those too. Alright, nothing doing on those three. We're going to keep it moving. Someone. I hear something. position though. I don't know where he was. Maybe I got him? That was a blind fire. There's no way I got anything with that, but maybe. Now we got him. Don't worry about that later. We don't want to linger out here, especially with just causing a stir. And yeah, I'm going to move right in. I know we've probably got someone here, so I'm just going to be aggressive and push at least enough to get into position. Gold chain. That might not be here if this place had been occupied. Let's see. This door's not open up here. We might be might be in a good spot here, guys. You telling me nobody spawned in here? Don't mind if I do. Let the GPU search begin. Come on, man. <laughs> you guys have been stiffing us hard. Repack while we're doing this. Search this one. Yeah. Oh, maybe. Nope. Uh, come on, man. <laughs> we have hit a dry spell on GPUs, guys. But that's all right. get that just in case we get hungry right all 
Alright. Only need to get lucky once. Uh, I mean, unless we want to find more than just the one. <laughs> then we need to get lucky a few more times than that. But. I don't know. Man. They really aren't liking us tonight, are they? here okay what is our extract nagatani okay i'm gonna go ahead and push out um if we run into someone we do but from here we could go back towards mira but there's no guarantee mira would be available when we got there um and nagatani is right here we have a decent amount of stuff so we're just gonna go ahead and take the quick win here push the extract and reset the safe you guys it's not as searchable as it once was same thing with this guy probably a little dangerous to do this here but we're gonna do it anyway so I don't know how much room we would get out of that probably not worth messing with nah. Okay, just gonna reset here, and we'll check our scab timer. If it's not up, we'll just come right back on our PMC and see what we can do. I've never done it on PvP yet, so I'm interested to see kind of how it how it goes. Why get up? All right, so where we are actually. I think two things. We're gonna go down this way and check these computers by the entrance first and then we're going to loop back around and go to uh to the other route and we'll end at Nagatani now on scav I do tend to be a little more free in terms of how much running I'm doing Someone is on the big gun anyway, so. Jeez. Okay, we know you're up there. Calm down. Jeez. I don't know if that's a scav or what, but still someone wants to shoot the big gun. Ah, I'm stuck on a box. Well, we got food on the counter, so good sign. Maybe we can actually get some looting done here. HCD. Oh, Marlboro, we need those. That's coming with us. I mean, I don't need them. My character doesn't need them. But Mechanic wants them, so. We'll, uh, we'll be feeding his bad habit. That's the name of the quest, I guess. This looks juicy. Let's take it.
Alright. Didn't look like he was aggroed to anyone, so should be okay here. Alright, maybe this one. Cord, sure, we'll take it. This room doesn't look like it's been looted at all. Hmm. Yeah, not worried about that last piece of gear. I do want to hit this computer though, because those didn't look looted. We know we had someone up on that big gun, so we'll see what's in that building. We're waiting on. Oh shit. <laughs> yep, someone's still in there. From the big gun, they can't shoot us down here. And I want to check and see if uh, those computers have been searched. So, again. I push in, I'm just gonna push in quickly. Scab talk. No scab talk back. Damn it. Uh, why did I hit crouch? Somehow I hit crouch, dude. I should have known it was a PMC. Why am I... <laughs> Why did I give him the chance to go around? Yeah, I knew, man. For some reason, I had my finger on, on X instead of D, and I meant to strafe there. <laughs> it totally laid down. Jesus. Well, you know, sometimes they don't end in the best of ways, but either way, they all come to an end eventually as does this episode um so if you're in stream hang tight uh, we'll be um still going but if you're watching the video appreciate you guys checking us out um we've got a few more gpus to get but 11 out of 15 i feel like is pretty good for the stream and uh, i'll be working on some of that off cam just because bitcoin is going to be piling up but i do appreciate all of you coming along for the journey um we'll call it on the episode there and i will see you in the next one be good to one another peace